Now, next is area of circle. The, cir the area of a circle having radius r is given by pi r square. Also, the circumference of circle is 2 pi r that is equal to pi into 2 r that is 2 r is equal to d the diameter of the circle. So, circumference of the circle can be pi into d where d is the diameter of the circle. Now, area of semicircle is half the area of the circle. It is equal to half pi r square. Example based on it. See, find the circumference and the area of the circle whose radius is 7.7 centimeter. Now, here radius is 7.7 centimeter and as we know the area of circle is given by pi r square. So, value of pi we have taken here is 2 by 2, 2 22 upon 7 into radius is 7.7 .7 square. It gives 186.34 centimeter square. Therefore, area of given circle is 186.34 centimeter square. Next is find the area of the door shown in the diagram. The top part of the door is a semicircle. So, door is the combination of two figures first is rectangle and second is semicircle. Okay. So, to find the total area of the given diagram, we have to first find out the rectang uh, area of rectangle and area of semicircle. The total area will be getting by, uh, if you add the area of rectangle and uh, area of semicircle, it will give the total area of the diagram. So, uh, total area is equals to AT, area of the rectangle is AR, area of semicircle is AS. So, area of given figure is equal to area of the rectangle plus area of the semicircle. That is, AT is equal to AR plus AS. Now, here radius is of 40 centimeter. Therefore, diameter will be 80 centimeter and therefore, length PQ is equal to 80 centimeter and height H is 160 centimeter. Now, first calculation of area of rectangle. Here, uh, length of the rectangle is 80 centimeter and height is 160 centimeter. Therefore, area of rectangle is given by L into H that is equals to 80 into 160 and that is equals to 12,800 square centimeter. Now, calculation of area of semicircle. Here, diameter is of 80 centimeter. Therefore, radius is 40 centimeter. Now, area of semicircle that is A s is given by 1 up by 1 by 2 pi r square. Therefore, A s is equal to 1 by 2 into 22 upon 7 into 40 square. Therefore, A s is equal to 2514.28 centimeter square. Therefore, the area of the door that is A t is equal to A r plus A s that is equal to 12800 plus 2514.28 that is equals to 15314.28 centimeter square. So, so far we have learned the area of square, parallelogram, circle, triangle, rectangle, trapezium. Area of square is A square where A is the length of this side. Area of parallelogram that is B into H, B is the base and H is the vertical height. Area of the circle that is pi r square. Area of semicircle is 1 by 2 pi r square. Area of triangle that is 1 by 2 B into H where B is the base and H is the vertical height. Area of rectangle is W into H where W is the weight, H is equals to height. Trapezium, area of trapezium is given by half a plus b into h where a and b are the base length and h is the 
वर्टिकल हाइट नेक्स्ट इज सरफेस एरिया ऑफ सॉलिड ऑब्जेक्ट्स इन दिस वी विल लर्न द सरफेस एरिया ऑफ क्यूबॉइड क्यूब सिलेंडर स्फीयर एंड हेमिसफीयर बिफोर डैट लेट्स ऑब्जर्व सम थ्री डी ऑब्जेक्ट्स फर्स्ट इज क्यूबॉइड क्यूबॉइड हैज सिक्स एजिज सिक्स फेसिस इट इज सिक्स सरफेसिस थ्री सरफेसिस मिट्स टू एजिज विच आर दी लाइन्स एंड दिस एजिज मिट टू वर्टाइसिस विच आर पॉइंट्स नेक्स्ट इज सिलेंडर सिलेंडर हैज टू सर्क्यूलर टू सर्क्यूलर सरफेसिस एंड वन कव सरफेस दैट इज लेटर सरफेस कौन कौन हैज वन लेटर सरफेस एंड वन सर्क्यूलर सरफेस दैट इज द बेज इट हैज वन पॉइंट एट द टॉप क्यूब क्यूब हैज सिक्स एजिज एंड दिस एजिज सिक्स फेसिस एंड दिस फेसिस आर आइडेंटिकल नाउ सी फेसिस ऑफ अ सॉलिड शेप्स फर्स्ट वन इज क्यूबाइडल बॉक्स All six faces are rectangle in the cuboidal box and opposite faces are identical. So we can get three pairs of identical faces in the cuboidal box. Let's see the cubical box. In cubical box all six faces are square and identical. Third is cylindrical box. In cylindrical box one cow surface and two circular surfaces which are identical now surface area the total surface area of a surface is of a three dimensional object is called sorry the total area of the surface is of a three dimensional objects is called surface area now surface area of cuboid see if we take a cuboidal box and if we cut it and open it if we lay it uh, lay it flat we get this type of diagram which is shown in the figure which is label 1 to 6 and if we carefully observe this figure we will see there is a four rectangles which are identical that is having same a uh, four rectangle of same height not identical okay to find out the surface area of the cuboid we have to find out the area of all these rectangles that is area of rectangle first rectangle second area of third rectangle uh, third rectangle area of fourth and so on area of sixth rectangle so let's find the area of first rectangle so in first rectangle height is h and length is l so area is equal to h into l for second breadth is, breadth length is l and height is b therefore area is given by l into h l into b same way we can find the area of third fourth fifth and sixth rectangle so it is equal to h into l plus b into l plus b into h plus l into h plus b into h plus l into b that is equal to 2 into l into h plus b into h plus b into l that is equal to 2 lb plus bh plus hl so total surface area of cuboid is given by 2 times lb plus bh plus hl next is cube now as we know that cube has six faces and these faces are identical so length of each face is a so area of one face is a square therefore total surface area of a cube is equal to 6 into area of one face that is equal to a square therefore area of surface uh, surface area of cube is 6a square example 
find the surface area of a cube having length 1 by 2 cm so surface area of a cube is given by 6a square that is equal to 6 into 1 by 2 square that is equal to 6 into 1 by 4 is equal to 1.5 square centimeter next is cylinder here the area of the rectangle sheet of the length 2 pi r and breadth h gives the curved surface area of a cylinder see if we take the cylindrical box cylind uh, cylindrical box if we cut it then we will see that it has two circular area two circular face faces and the curved surface it represents the rectangle so area of curved surface is the length of the rectangle see the curved surface therefore curved surface area of cylinder is equal to area of rectangular sheet that is equals to perimeter of base into height that is equals to 2 pi into h that is equal to 2 pi r h so total surface area of cylinder is equal to 2 pi into r plus h where h is the height of the cylinder and r is the radius of the base let's see the example a uh, cylinder is having radius 8 cm and height 12 cm calculate the total surface area of this cylinder so total surface area of cylinder is given by 2 pi r into r plus h here radius r is 8 cm height h is 12 cm therefore surface area is equal to 2 into 22.7 into 8 into 8 plus 12 that is equals to 1005.71 cm square for a cuboid the height length and weight are given by 13 cm 35 cm and 13 cm find the volume of this cuboid now volume of cuboid is given by l into w into h l is the length w is the width and h is the height of this cubit cube cuboid therefore volume is 10010 cm cube next is surface area of a cone now as we know that cone is made up of two surfaces one is curved surface and second is circular surface so curved surface area of a cone is half l into 2 pi r that is equal to pi r l where 2 pi r is the area of sur sur circumference of the base of the cone therefore total surface area of cone is pi r l plus pi r square that is equal to pi r into l plus r where r is the base radius of the cone s is the slant, slant height of a cone and h is the height of a cone and l is equal to square root of r square plus h square example how many square meters of cloth is required to, re to prepare four conical tents of diameter 8 meter and height 3 meter now to find the required cloth to prepare four conical tent first we have to find this line height l that is l is equal to square root of h square plus r r square here h is equals to 3 meters and r is equal to 4 meter therefore l is equal to square root of 3 square plus 4 square it is equal to square root of 9 plus 16 it is equal to square root of 25 and that is equals to 5 centimeter now lateral surface area of a cone is given by pi r l therefore pi r l is equal to 3.14 into 4 into 5 that is equal to 62.8 meter square therefore to prepare a required tent to prepare the tent 
required length of the cloth is 62.8 meter square four times 62.8 meter square that is equals to 251.2 meter square cloth next is volume of a solid object in this we will learn the volume of cuboid cube cylinder cone sphere and hemisphere volume amount of space occupied by a three dimensional object is called volume of the object capacity capacity refers to the quantity that a container hold now volume and capacity as we know that volume refers to the amount of space occupied by an object whereas capacity refers to the quantity that a container hold the relation between liter centimeter cube and meter cube 1 milliliter is equals to 1 centimeter cube now we know that 1 liter is equal to 1000 milliliter therefore we can write 1 liter is equals to 1000 centimeter cube if we multiply both the sides by 1000 we will get 1000 liter is equals to 1000 into 1000 centimeter cube it is equal to 100 into 100 into 100 centimeter cube therefore 1000 liter is equal to 100 raised to 3 centimeter cube now 1 uh, 1 meter is equals to 100 centimeter therefore we get 1000 liter is equal to 10 raised to 6 centimeter cube see volume of a cuboid if we observe this figure carefully we will see the base of the cuboid is a parallelogram so volume of cuboid is given by base area into height that is l into b into h that is equal to l b h volume of the cube as cube has all the equal all the faces of equal side therefore volume of cube is a cube where a is the edge of the cube example based on it calculate the volume of a cube whose length of 1